Hello and welcome to the IG Market News. I'm Brenda Kelly. Today is the 25th of September 2013. We're expecting something of a softer start to the US Open at the moment. And of course, given that the Dow has fallen for the last four consecutive days, uh, we could be in for a deeper correction. The Dow Jones itself is up around 18 to 19 percent year to date, but certainly being four and a half percent away from that 16,000 level does create a something of a target for those bulls. But from the point of view of the longer term, it is very well worth taking a top-down approach to technical analysis. And from that point of view, I have looked at the monthly chart for the Dow Jones. You can see that we are in this channel, and we have actually hit the top band of that particular channel. Looking at the price action for August, well as well, it has eclipsed something uh, to a degree of the July price action. So what will be important to look at now will be the monthly close on the Dow Jones. We have hit a high of 15,700 or thereabouts this year. Uh, but given that we are so close to that 16,000 target and also looking at the RSI, which is markedly quite overbought and looking at when it was last overbought, the correction that we saw therein, it is something to take note of. And this could be a warning of a significant reversal about to take place. Place. We saw something similar as well when the markets went oversold and we saw a big move up from that particular point. Looking at the 21 month average, we are also quite far uh, from that particular point and this has generally speaking been acting as quite a decent supportive level for the markets as it moves in the, in the waves that it does. So being 12% above that does actually make a pointer that we could see a pullback from the particular zone that we're in. As I said, it will be important to watch to see what the monthly close for September will be to give us further clues as to where the markets might bring us. For more information, log on to IG.com.